did you mirror your game off any player in particular? Um, not particularly. Um, no, because when I was growing up, I was um, I started out cornerback, <laughs> cornerback and wing back, centre back. It was only when I got to under twenty or under twenty one level I started playing. I started off wing back and then moved to midfield, then to wing forward, and then um, I got put in full forward one day and scored like two goals, two four or something. And I think I've been there since. <laughs> <laughs> I know I so read I, before um they said you're a bit of a late bloomer. Would you say it like that or I it probably was. Like I'd often like even I'm a school teacher and I'd be self and Connor are coaching juveniles and there's different lads that you'd see who are smaller and there's other lads that you'd see who are bigger and just the, the they grow at different levels. So I would have been one of the smaller lads. You're always having to battle for every ball and you're fighting your corner all the time because the bigger lads just come in and push you out of the way. Um and then I suppose through the even start then I started started to grow and get stronger and that and it would have you always you have that small man mentality where you have to battle for everything and then as you grow you you don't lose that so you still remember that and you still have that bit of aggression in you so it probably it probably helps from that but yeah I'd say it would have been a late bloomer just probably that and and interest as well kind of lost with interest in football as well um when you're kind of just a teenager as well, you just don't have that same, sometimes so many different things going on and just lacking a small bit of interest. Probably just, probably wasn't good enough or thought I wasn't good enough as well. And that's what would, would have probably made me more reluctant to, to push hard at it. But um, yeah, I think it's, I think it's for, for young development, I think it's so important that um, you don't get carried away with this. Don't leave it by leaving off small lads. They could be the lads you look for in, in, in five or 10 years when they've uh, hit their growth spurt or whatever it might be. 